In this tutorial, you are going to learn how to format a hard drive in Windows XP, which is actually a relatively simple process. First of all, you are going to need to have a partitioned hard disk. Click on Start, and then My Computer. Locate the hard disk that you want to format. In this case, it is the F drive. It is not possible to format your primary drive, probably labeled C, in Windows XP itself, as it contains Windows. Right-click on the drive and in the menu that appears, click Format. A window which has the formatting options will appear. Make sure that you have the right drive selected. Choose a file system, which is probably best left as it is. Create a new label for the drive if you wish, and then click Start. A dialog box will appear confirming that you want to format the disk. Remember, this will wipe all the data from the disk, so do not click OK if there is any information on the drive that you want to keep. Once you have clicked OK to confirm the format, a green progress bar will appear in the bottom of the formatting window, and after a while a dialog box will appear informing you that the format was completed. Click OK, and that is how to format a hard drive in Windows XP.